I know the controversy is of political nature, but uh, now that Kali is in picture, let me tell you what Kali means, she's time. All those skulls around her neck, the present imagery of Kali, of being fierce, chopping off demons' heads and all this, is only approximately fourteen to fifteen hundred years old. Kali worship has been there for many, many millennia. So these are more recent images and in the last two, three centuries, she's become more of a benevolent mother. Ultimately, your skull also will hang on her mala one day because she's time. Because of that, time is always dancing away, never stopping, isn't it? Both in terms of space and time, you occupy just a speck of this cosmos. So Kali represents both time and space. The word Kali means… Kala means time, Kala also means emptiness or Kali also means emptiness or space. So there is only one term in yoga for both time and space because we don't see it differently.